Saber now has hand tracking, kind of. In this video I'll be showing how to set up and install the hand tracking feature and what a level would look like with it enabled. Assuming you already have sideloaded BMBF, you can find this mod in the BSMG to download. If you haven't installed BMBF then there are plenty of tutorials on the internet to help you out with sideloading, setting up developer mode and sideloading BMBF. And everything I mentioned in this video will be linked in the description to make your life a lot easier. In the BSMG, go to the Quest Mods channel and scroll up until you find the mod called Finger Saber by Drum Tool. From there, click the Download tab and it should open up a new Google tab with the QMod folder downloaded at the bottom and can be found in your Downloads folder. Load up your Oculus Quest or Oculus Quest 2 and open up BMBF and then go to the Tools tab where in the corner you should see an IP address. Type the IP address into a browser and you should be greeted with a upload tab for BMBF. Drag the Finger Saber mod into BMBF and then press Sync to Beat Saber. Now you should be able to load up Beat Saber with hand tracking without Zuckerberg stopping you. Once all set up you can load up a map whether it being an OST, DLC or custom map and here is what it should look like. Hand tracking is great and fun to mess around with in Beat Saber. First note, hand tracking is an experimental feature, so it's not something you're going to use to get a full combo and spin eternally. I hope you that you enjoyed this video. Please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. And on screen is a very quick overview on the new Beat Saber Skrillex pack. Bye.